हेलो दिस इज द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक ऑफ ग्रेविटेशन दैट इज ग्रेविटेशनल पोटेंशियल एनर्जी एंड एसके फिलोसफी वेन वी कंसिडर द एनर्जी एज वी नो द एनर्जी ऑफ टू टाइप्स वन इज पोटेंशियल एनर्जी विच इज द एनर्जी पजेसेस्ट बाय बॉडी ऑन अकाउंट ऑफ इट्स पोजिशन it is called potential energy and second is kinetic energy with the energy possessed by body on account of its motion is called kinetic energy this energy which is stored in the object is because of its position and the energy this energy is relative relative it means it depends upon position suppose this is the surface of earth and the energy when we go to the height say h from the ground having mass say m of that object then as we know g gravitational acceleration then potential energy is nothing but mgh as h from the ground and g is the gravitational acceleration of that mg object m mass m then potential energy is mgh here g decreases with height increases g decreases with height increases for object at infinite distance from the earth value of g is zero and there is no earth's gravitational force no earth gravitational force here when object is at height h from the surface of earth then what is potential energy this potential energy can be negative no doubt because it is less than zero for smaller distances minus g m m upon r plus h what is the h h is height capital r it is the radius of earth this is earth radius and g is the universal gravitational constant capital m is the mass of earth and this is the one potential energy here this is about gravitational potential energy this is the potential energy. now let us see what is escape velocity let us consider one experiment when ball is thrown upwards its velocity decreases as we go away from earth because of gravitation of earth and the velocity at this point are uh, at last velocity is equal to zero at certain height and after that object or you may say whatever it may be stone suppose it starts falling down maximum height depends on its initial velocity very important maximum velocity depends on its initial velocity means as initial velocity more then there will be maximum height newton's equations of motions let us consider one newton's equation of motion this is the newton's equation of motion v is equal to u square plus twice s here a is equal to negative because from downward to upward g is negative therefore we say a is negative 
here s is the say displacement or uh, you may say height and here final velocity final velocity is zero therefore zero is equal to u square minus twice a g s therefore s is equal to minus u square upon twice g here higher the initial velocity u larger is the height reached by the ball what is the reason for this that the higher the initial velocity the ball will oppose the gravity here gravitational direction is from upward to downward therefore it oppose the gravity of earth more and larger will be height this is the relation between them now let us consider some more concepts regarding respect to escape velocity if we keep increasing the initial velocity of ball suppose we are going to increase v means this is the symbol of man and this is the ball you may say if we keep increasing the initial velocity of ball it will be reach larger and larger heights okay and at certain time or at particular value of velocity initial velocity what you written with that initial velocity that particular initial velocity at particular initial velocity of the ball ball is able to overcome the downward pull of the by the earth and can escape the earth forever forever always forever and will not come back on the earth and this type of velocity is called escape velocity escape velocity is the initial velocity which is used to go from this earth field in space and if it goes forever then they will not fall back on the earth and therefore this is termed as escape velocity here object going vertically upwards from the surface of earth having initial velocity equal to escape velocity this initial velocity is equal to escape velocity this is the formula you may say and the force of gravity being inversely proportional to square of the distance between them and it becomes a zero only at infinite distance when f is equal to zero if r is infinity one upon infinity means zero that is f is equal to zero if this distance is at infinite uh, infinite time distance and therefore uh, this will be the we can find the escape velocity from this now one more term regarding this escape velocity this is the space from this uh, earth and its climate atmosphere beyond that there is a space and when space travelers travels in space then in that space craft it appears to be floating in that space craft what will happen what is the reason behind to float it because value of g is important in the space station value of g is only 11% less than value of g on surface of earth means 11% less here keep in mind that height of spacecraft suppose this is the spacecraft and height of spacecraft is not the reason for weightlessness what i say height of the craft from surface of earth is not the reason for the weightlessness but this weightlessness which is in that spacecraft 
is caused by being state of free fall this is the ek one position state of free fall and therefore we got uh, weightlessness in that spacecraft this is the total description regarding gravitation let us see uh, we will see the next in next video examples and uh, some thoughts regarding this chapter okay good day